So I was looking for a very special gift for a very special baby that has a very special mother and my mum said buy her a blanket. Everyone buys um, new mum's blankets and throws and things like that and I thought no and I didn't want to buy a teddy. I, didn't, I just wanted to buy something special that would give her many uses and something that she was going to be able to use for a long time and I chose this baby activity play mat um, it says it's by DM and it's by Pure Designs and um, I looked at the pictures and I liked it um, I liked that it was on offer I liked I don't know I like the design because it's not a modern modern but it's not a classic classic so it's somewhere kind of in between so it has arrived now and I'm just going to quickly share my thoughts with you. So you don't understand how big this parcel actually is. It was difficult for me to take the picture. I didn't know where to place it because it took that much space. Um, it's huge, it's utterly huge and it's so thick and fluffy um, so do expect a big box from Amazon and inside the big box you're going to receive a big uh, plastic bag as you can see on the picture um, completely sealed with sellotape and it's like almost I would say when I first saw it I thought god it's like a cot quilt um, it's that kind of packaging so you have yourself an idea so I could actually get all boring and say, oh, it has um, 400 grams every meter, cubic meter of filling. But I can just say, I took it out the bag. I wanted to do the review. I wanted to see where I had purchased. Now, the label speaks about the polyester um, material filling inside, okay? and it actually is cotton on the outside it's super thick and um, you know the high thread count cotton the super um, super thick good quality cotton it's soft and it's generous when you touch it and the feeling it definitely has very good feeling now it says it's hand wash only but i'm a mom of five and by personal experience if you place an item like this on a low revolution, low reps um, wash, perhaps a delicate or even, I'm not sure, a 30 minute cold wash, I don't think there is a problem nowadays with putting it inside the washing machine, especially because it's going to be for babies. Um, to dry, you can either line dry or if it was me, I would just put it inside the tumble dryer but I would actually put it on the delicate setting. Now, re let's remember that delicate settings on dryers nowadays can actually dry silk, can actually dry wool without causing any damage to the materials. So the machines we have nowadays are not the machines that used to be available before. And I am sure don't let that label because when you've got a newborn baby and you receive something or you buy something and it's hand washed, your eyes kind of roll, don't, don't they? Because you think, oh my God, more work. <laughs> As if I didn't have enough. Well, don't worry about it because I think that a delicate or quick 30 degree wash and a delicate tumble dry, keeping an eye on it and your baby mat is 100% safe in the washing machine and the tumble dryer. Okay, so I've tried to take a picture to show you how fluffy it is, but it was impossible. On that picture, I actually uh, folded the mat in half and then in half again. And I was pressing really hard with my hand and I was taking a picture with the other, but it just doesn't move. It's just so fluffy and dense. It just stays in place. Um, so I thought, how on earth am I going to show other moms, other dads, other grandmas, aunties, because you might be wanting to buy this mat for someone else as a gift, but maybe you're thinking of buying it for yourself for your baby. So do please excuse the next picture to come. I have tried my best, um, but I hope it helps you get an idea of the density of the mat itself. Okay, I am very sorry, but I thought 
what can I put on top that's not going to get the mat dirty or you know because if I bought the fresh juice um, it's from the fridge so I thought okay I've got some olives you know the big nine and 935 grams of olives and um, it's the massive one from Tesco's there's no bigger than that one and I thought I'm going to put it on top and see what happens because when I bought the product it kind of got my attention the fact the picture on the left that has four books on top and you can still see that the mat has two centimeters thickness so i thought hmm okay um let's find a kilo of pasta or something like that but in the end i went for the olives because there's nothing heavier for me than that part of olives and if you look at the first picture again it's folded in four um sorry yes it's four layers but it's folded once and then again so it's folded twice and as you can see it just dips in just like if it was as soft as feathers to be honest i know it's polyester filling but the feeling's so dense and fluffy it kind of has that feeling so then on the second picture i thought okay that's because there's a lot of layers let's just leave it with two layers and as you can see it does the same effect on the first one and then the second one is just as fluffed up you can see it on the third picture I know it's olives, do please excuse me, but I just wanted to show you that your baby is going to be so comfortable on top of this mat. You know, I wish um, when I had my kids and they were smaller, I, I, sh I bought a mat this soft and fluffy. Um, I did not find one like this one. I'm very impressed and I'm very happy with it. So the seller says, it's a one meter 20 by one meter 20 that's 3.9 feet i i get it but i thought where can i just open it up and show the size now that's my king size bed and um, i do have a double layer of cushions at the top okay uh, but just so you know this lower part here this one here this is the end of my bed okay and that reaches the top the top of the second layer of cushions so i have one layer of cushions there and another layer of cushions but there again this is a king size bed and it does have my very big quilt on top which actually fluffs up the bed itself and um, so if you imagine the size yes if you want it this can be used as a quilt and uh, for the cot this can be used as a play mat this can be laid on top of a sofa and you can put your baby um, nicely on top. It can be used for so many things. And I know my friend's going to give it so many different uses. Um, and thanks to its size, it's going to last that not only for the first year of the baby's life, but hopefully um, for many years to come, which is what I wanted with my gift in the first place. So just to make sure you don't think that it's the way I've taken the picture, uh, before I was actually, um, I have a bench here, uh, but I was standing on the other side of the bench taking the pictures. And then I thought, okay, let's just um, get my stool and go on top of the stool and try and take a different view. Um, so moms and dads and everyone looking at this video can have an idea. And no, it's still huge. It's still covering almost my whole king size bed. And it's very generous in size and it's great because when babies are one onwards and they start rolling from one side to another you want a mat that's going to be big enough uh, for that baby to keep on top of the mat because the, if you buy them one of the little ones they roll twice and they're already out <laughs> so it's ideal to be honest I just wanted to show you every single angle possible So oh yes, this is the picture that was on the product page. Um, as you can see, it's big. And when I saw the one on the kitchen, the one on the right, I actually thought that must be a very small kitchen. Well, now I can confirm with everyone, it's not a small kitchen, it's a big mat. <laughs> Another positive thing that I see on this mat is that it's completely square. So. Uh, as I've already said, it's 1 meter 20 by 1 meter 20, 3.9 feet. And I have on the picture on the right, what I actually done, I kind of folded in triangle 
and yes it is completely square but it's very good because you can place your baby in the middle it's a better design actually than when they're rectangle um, and they are longer than wider or wider than longer so it's perfect as what it is a play mat where it can also have many other uses the design the design is actually a double color so it has a i would say it's off white it's not cream it's not beige i am not um, a fan of beige or cream colors because i've always said they look dirty whites um, this mat doesn't look dirty white it just looks like an off white but a clean white if that makes sense I'm, i hope somebody understands what i'm trying to say it's a lovely tone of white creamish um color off white i think it's the perfect way to describe it now on that side it's off white um creamish <laughs> and then it has little stars which are dark navy color i was in between a um light gray or a dark navy i go more for the dark navy and on the opposite side is the other way around you have the background which is the um, the dark navy uh, light gray shade i go although i definitely go more for navy and then you have the little off-white um stars it's ideal because you can choose either side um, obviously as a mom of five i would preferably preferably prefer uh, the darkest side always on the floor but then again it's it's up to you you know it's up to you you have both sides so you can take your pick Um, here I just tried to show you the colour, um, the, there again the top layer, the bottom layer with the off-white, it is honestly a beautiful combination and to be honest with you it's completely unisex so I have bought it for a baby boy but even if it was for a baby girl it would work just the same, it would be just as nice so it's suitable for both. And I thought, what better way <laughs> than a baby with a thumb up? It's definitely a thumbs up. Um, I'm going to see my friend tomorrow. I've already wrapped it. I'm very excited. I'm very happy with my purchase. It hasn't let me down. Um, furthermore, it's actually impressed me. I didn't expect this much. Um, it, it's arrived on time, so I'm going to take it to her tomorrow, and then I will update on the comments. But I know she's going to be extremely happy it's superb so if you're thinking of buying this mat as a gift go for it it's worth every single penny and if you think of buying it for yourselves for your little ones all i can say is that i wish i would have bought it many years ago when my little ones were even smaller so thank you very much for your time thanks for listening